Hello, hello everyone! Welcome to our channel. My name is Katya and I'm a Russian English speaking YouTuber from Volgograd. And today I'm filming a very special video for you. It is about the local Volgograd fast food. And this video is especially unique because I'm doing it not alone. I'm doing it with another amazing Russian English speaking YouTuber, Nastya. She lives in Vladivostok in the far east of Russia, really far from us. It is not surprising that this part of Russia is called like this, the Far East, because it's really, really far from us. So we've decided to film such an interesting video for you and to compare the fast food in Russia in different parts and in different cities. And if you like to watch my vlogs, please, at the end of this video, go to Nastya's channel, write her hello from Katya, hello from Volgograd, and maybe something else, something kind, and something that can make her smile. I will be extremely grateful to you, my friends. And now let's jump right into the video. Let's start discussing our interesting topic. I want to start this video telling you about five most popular types of fast food here in Volkberg. What do you think when you hear fast food? I'm sure that you think of hamburgers, cheeseburgers, pizza and something like this. But no, my friends, it is not typical of my hometown. Pizza and burgers are really popular here, but I should say that we treat this kind of food not just like fast food, not the way you do, especially people in America. Because here in Volgograd and in Russia, I should say, uh, hamburgers and pizza are rather expensive. And when we go to the restaurants where we can have something like this, we treat these places like real restaurants. We do this on weekends with our families. Young men invite their girlfriends to such restaurants. So this is not the Volgograd fast food. The top five Volgograd fast food are pilmeni. <laughs> oh, I'm sure that you understand that it's not the food that you can eat hurrying somewhere, running in the streets or so on. But if you are really hungry and if you are hurrying home, you can buy pilmeni in every supermarket, run to your house, uh, cook it very fast because pilmeni can be cooked really fast, I should say. And then eat them. And Russians adore pilmeni. Pilmeni can be called the main uh, man food here. <laughs> the second popular fast food are different bakery products. There are a lot of bakery shops around and all our children and also adults like to buy different piroshki, Russian pies, some sweet buns, some sandwiches and so on, everything like this that you can find in such a shop. The third popular fast food product is of course shawarma. We call it shawarma in Volgorod, but you can also hear shavirma and this means that this person is from St. Petersburg, because we do not say shavirma. It is something ridiculous. We say shawarma. Shawarma is treated to be a Caucasian dish. And as my hometown is situated close to the Caucasian region, there are a lot of amazing places where you can eat gorgeous shawarma here. There are two more types of fast food. I think the most popular ones. The first one is Russian blini. Oh, I think I even pronounced it like Boris. <laughs> two Russian pancakes, crepes, or something like this, how you call these things. But here in Russia we call them blini, and you can find them absolutely everywhere. I love them, I should say, and they are very traditional, very Russian, and very delicious. And the first type of fast food here in Volgograd, the legend of Volgograd, one of the informal symbols of my hometown, Katleta Pakiski. I do not know how to translate it correctly into English because I think that it is something like chicken kiev, but I do not like this translation. It is stupid. Uh, what chicken? <laughs> In Russian, it is uh, literally called a cutlet, but I know that you call some other things cutlets, not like in Russia. In Russia, a cutlet is such a meatball fried on the pan or made in the oven. It can be from vegetables, but it is mostly from meat. And this cutlet is called the cutlet from Kyiv. I should say that it's the thing that all the people here in Volgograd love. And moreover, you can find it absolutely everywhere. When I was a student, it was the best snack that we could have for pretty little money. First of all, I've prepared some interesting facts about this glorious dish for you. 
This is the so-called legend of Volgograd, Katleta Pakivsky, a cutlet from Kyiv. It is both a Russian and a Ukrainian dish, but originally it appeared in St. Petersburg in 1912. This is a breaded chicken fillet chop in which a piece of butter is wrapped. The resulting cutlet has an ellipsoid shape and is deep fried. It may have different traditional fillings such as grated cheese, mushrooms, herbs and ham. All this can be added to the butter. But rather a big piece of butter in the middle of it is one of the most important parts of this dish. It is funny that in the Soviet era it was one of the most popular dishes in the restaurant. But then it somehow turned into street food. The main town where you can eat it in the streets is Volgograd. And now we are going to go and find this amazing cutlet from Kyiv somewhere here in Volgograd. Let's search for kotleti po Kyivsky in my Russian neighborhood. Just look at this amazing red communist bird feeders. Someone built a balcony. <laughs> you can see that there are no more balconies here in this apartment block, but someone decided that uh, this person needs a balcony and just build it. Lenin Square. Literally the best thing we can do in this vlog is to find the legendary Volker snack in the legendary Volker place. We're going to return here, but now we're going to go here. I was scared that I would be asked my ticket but it is not like this I can go down You can see how many delicious things you can buy here. Tichy Malako, birth milk, one of the most popular candies here. Midavik, honey cake, and tea. котлетки по-киевски обычные. Алло. Обычные три штучки. Дайте, пожалуйста. Now the video is turning into a mukbang. And behind you can see the statue of Lenin. I do not know how to show you the statue. Well, this киевская uh, котлета, chicken Kiev or Kiev котлет with chicken, cost me six rubles. And it's rather expensive, I should say. Most such cutlets usually cost at about 35, 40 rubles if you buy them somewhere in the kiosk. And it's rather expensive. But it should be more delicious, I think. I hope, at least. 
so let's try it is rather challenging to try it and not to get dirty because uh, there is much butter inside of it and you can split it onto your clothes and it's a rather typical situation so let's try mm. Mm. I'm very sorry, I do not know how to eat this thing in a beautiful way. Look, rather disgusting, I should say, but it's really delicious. As I've already told you, there are some fillings. Uh, you can put only the butter there, or you can put some mushrooms, some cheese, some ham there. And sometimes there is some butter with uh, garlic and with some herbs. So, my dearest friends, that was all for today. If you want to see the videos about the other four types of fast food in Volkrad, write me in comments, please. And now I want to remind you that this video is filmed together with my friend Nastya from Vladivostok. And it's high time to go to her channel. I'm going to leave the link for you somewhere here. And I will be very grateful to you if you subscribe to her channel say her hello and if you watch her vlogs because she's an amazing girl and she's a professional teacher of russian by the way and i want to say thank you as always my dearest friends thank you very much for watching this video just look how beautiful is everything around it is almost spring here in Volgograd. so see you in the next vlog don't forget to subscribe if you are new and thank you one more time my friends